Well, hello, everybody, and welcome to this edition of Aspiring Answers. I'm Brian. And I'm Mark. Hey, in our previous session, we talked about the challenges of, of companies having too many projects running in parallel. And in there, we talked about this sort of concept of short and fat. Not really sure what that means. And Mark, can you tell us a little bit about that? Well, the opposite, working long and scary. Skinny. It, it basically means that we, um, we're having a whole portfolio of things we, we can do. And if we start all of them at the same time, we are distributing our resources among uh, all of them. So that would usually uh, lead to that we are working on, on many, many things at the same time, but also that they stretch out and take a long time to complete them, exactly because our resources are scattered. When we work short and fat instead, we postpone starting up the majority of our projects and only start the one or the very few that has the highest value first. So, of course, the advantages of that is that when we put all of our resources on the most important thing, we will finish it off faster and also start to get the benefits, start to get the value of the products, uh, the product we launch, the services we launch, get that faster. We also get higher productivity from the people because they are not switching tasks all the time. They're focused on razor sharp on the, uh, on, on the one thing they're working on. And we also avoid waiting for the, the experts, the bottlenecks around the organization, because everybody is just focused on the one thing at the same time. Great thoughts, great thoughts. So they walk away from this, I think, about we want to be short and fat so that we get a few projects done sooner. Or we can get you know, some value from, from the first project soon and then following on after that. We gain overall pro productivity with less switching costs, less waiting around for experts and bottlenecks, um, and then less time for things to change because we do the projects faster. So those are all great things to take away and great ways to think about how to run our projects short and fat and to deliver more value faster. Thanks for those great ideas, Mark. 